In this week's Training Minute, we will look at the Kirkpatrick model. The objective is to recognize Kirkpatrick's four levels of training evaluation. With the increase in the amount of training being offered to employees in all industries, organizations need to be concerned with evaluating it for the following three reasons. For both participants and trainers and developers, feedback allows for adjustments to learning strategies or training activities. Decision making. Evaluating training allows decisions to be made about format, content, learning strategies, and the trainer's ability to deliver. Evaluating training has an impact on marketing as it demonstrates the value of training to senior management and justifies the need for it or not. In order to address these points, the Kirkpatrick model, which is the most popular framework, is used to evaluate training. Introduced in 1959 and based largely on Raymond Katzel's model of training evaluation, American researcher Donald Kirkpatrick published a series of four articles that aim to define the levels of evaluation. Level 1. Reaction Equivalent to participant satisfaction with the training, this level assesses what they really think of the training and is done through questionnaires. Level 2. Learning Done through performance tests, this level evaluates the acquisition of knowledge, skills, and attitudes of the participants according to the training objectives. Level 3. Behavior This level determines if the participants' behaviors have changed following the training by evaluating the transfer of the knowledge, skills, and attitudes acquired during the training to the workstation. This evaluation is done two to three months after the training by means of a survey or interview in order to observe the targeted behaviors. Level 4. Organizational Results This last level evaluates the impact of the training on the organization by measuring indicators such as productivity, turnover rate, and quality of work. Although this is the most important level, it is rarely done because of the difficulty in linking the effects of the training to the measured outcomes. By evaluating training with Kirkpatrick's model, organizations will have the opportunity to improve the quality of the training offered to their employees, as well as the effectiveness of the training activities they participate in. We have now reached the end of this week's Training Minute. See you next week! For more information on our training courses, visit our website at actualisation.com or reach us at 1-877-688-0101. Actualisation, training and consulting since 1970.